everyone, welcome back to my channel, LT Talks RE. I'm Lisa Taylor with EXP Realty in Kingston, Ontario, and today we're tackling a topic that's kind of crucial for anyone looking to buy or sell a home, and that is market valuation. Have you ever wondered how real estate professionals determine the value of a property? Well, today we're going to demystify that process a bit and focus on the power of comparable properties. So let's dive in. All right, so market valuation, it's like giving your home a price tag, and it's not just a random number. Real estate experts often turn to one key to tool, and that is comparable properties, or comps for short. But how does it work? Let's break it down. First off, what are comparable properties? These are recently sold properties in the same or similar neighborhood with similar features. Think size, style, and amenities. Using comps helps us gauge the fair market value of that property based on what similar homes have sold for. We can also look at properties that are currently listed for sale that are similar. However, since we don't know what these are going to eventually sell for, they don't give us the full picture. So imagine you're selling a three bedroom, two bathroom house. To determine its value, we would look at other three bedroom, two bathroom homes that have recently sold in the area. It's kind of like creating a real estate family tree. Now the key here is recently sold. Markets can change and what a similar house sold for a year ago or even three months ago in some cases might not be the same as today. So we focus on the most recent transactions to capture the current pulse of the market. But how do we choose the right comps? It's like kind of like matchmaking for homes. We consider factors such as location, neighborhood, schools in the area, square footage, the number of bedrooms and bathrooms, and any unique features that impact value. The more similar, the better. Think of it like assembling a team of real estate doppelgangers, homes that closely resemble yours and in the game of property value. So here's where it gets a bit like fine tuning. Not every home is an exact copy, right? Well, thank goodness. So we make adjustments. If your home has a pool and the comp doesn't, we adjust. If one has a fancy kitchen upgrade, we adjust. These adjustments help us to fine tune the valuation for your unique property. It's a bit like giving each home in our comparison a scorecard, considering both the similarities and the differences. Let's take a look at a, a quick example. If a three bedroom home recently sold for let's say 600,000 and another very similar one with a pool and a beautiful outdoor living space sold for 650,000, we might adjust our valuation based on these differences like building a custom customized pricing strategy for your home. Or if one home offers all the same features, square footage and neighborhood, but one has been updated and one has the original owners and the original shag carpeting, these are all factors to consider. And there you have it. The, ma the magic of market valuation through comparable properties. It's not just about throwing darts at numbers. It's a strategic process using real data to determine your home's worth. So if you found this breakdown help helpful, give me a thumbs up. And if you have questions or want to share your own experiences with market valuation, drop them in the comments below. And of course, don't forget to subscribe for more real estate insights. Until next time, happy valuing. Market valuing? Market valuation? See ya.